Biometric identification means the automated recognition of physical, physiological, behavioral, or psychological human features. For the purpose of establishing the identity of a natural person, by comparing biometric data of that individual to biometric data of individuals stored in a database. However, the use of biometric identification systems also raises significant concerns regarding surveillance, privacy, discrimination, and accuracy. The EU Artificial Intelligence Act addresses these issues by classifying certain biometric systems as high risk and imposing stringent regulations on their deployment and use. Let's examine relevant details to understand the implications of the EU AI Act on biometric systems. Biometric data, being a special category of personal data, requires heightened protection due to its sensitive nature. The AI Act identifies high-risk use cases of biometric systems that pose significant risks, particularly concerning accuracy and discrimination. These risks are magnified when biometric systems are used for remote identification, where technical inaccuracies can lead to biased outcomes and discriminatory effects, especially concerning age, ethnicity, race, sex, or disabilities. Let's examine high-risk use cases and classifications of biometric systems. First are remote biometric identification systems. These are intended for remote biometric identification and attempt to identify people without their active involvement. Remote biometric identification AI systems are deemed high risk due to their potential for biased results and discriminatory effects. Second on our list are biometric verification systems. Biometric systems intended for identity verification, authentication, or access control purposes such as unlocking devices or accessing premises, are excluded from high-risk classification. These systems focus solely on confirming the identity of an individual for access purposes, rather than identifying sensitive attributes for other reasons. Third, we have biometric categorization and emotion recognition systems. AI systems designed for biometric categorization, as well as emotion recognition systems, are based on the processing of sensitive personal data, protected under data protection regulations. These are classified as high-risk AI, and can be used subject to legislative and regulatory guardrails, provided they are not prohibited under the EU AI Act, so, you need to be careful. Fourth on our list are artificial intelligence systems used for cybersecurity and data protection. Biometric systems used exclusively for cybersecurity controls and as data protection measures are not considered high risk. This is because the primary purpose of such AI systems is to enhance security rather than identify people based on sensitive attributes for other purposes. Now, let's examine implications for stakeholders in relation to the deployment and use of biometric AI systems. For developers and providers of AI-based biometric systems, compliance with high-risk classification entails rigorous adherence to regulatory standards, including transparency, accountability, and bias mitigation measures. As a developer or provider, you must maintain robust documentation of risk assessments and proactively engage with regulatory authorities to stay on top of compliance requirements and mitigate legal risks. Bear in mind that users and consumers of biometric technologies also benefit from increased transparency and accountability, as the high-risk classification prompts AI developers to prioritize accuracy, fairness, and privacy in system design, implementation and ongoing use. In summary, the classification of certain biometric systems as high-risk by the EU Artificial Intelligence Act reflects a proactive approach to addressing the unique challenges posed by biometric data processing. By imposing stringent regulations on high-risk use cases, the Act aims to safeguard privacy, prevent discrimination, and enhance the accuracy and fairness of AI-driven biometric systems. The global artificial intelligence governance market is on the brink of explosive growth set to soar from 890 million US dollars in 2025 to an astonishing 5.7 billion US dollars by 2029. That's an unmatched annual growth rate of over 45%.
making AI governance the gold rush profession of the decade. This isn't just a career opportunity. It's your chance to become a credible, strategic human in the loop, shaping how artificial intelligence, law and ethics converge to impact our world. Don't get left behind. Visit lawtofficialintegrity.ai and claim your place in the AI governance revolution.